Well, the campaign trail lands in California with the race to raise money. President Joe Biden in the Bay Area right now. Meantime, one of his Republican counterparts, Florida Governor Ron DeSantis, is trying to sway voters right here in the capital city. Thanks for staying with us here at 5 o'clock. I'm Curtis Ming. And I'm Marley Ginter. CBS 13's Andrew Hovner talked with Republican leaders and voters who went to the event. Andrew? Yeah, guys, those that attended today's event at Del Paso Country Club say that the governor of Florida left an impression and may create a tighter race in the Republican primaries than polling currently suggests. Florida Governor Ron DeSantis holding court in Sacramento today. When he dismissed some of the concerns that I had beforehand of being low energy and, and not really personally engaging, and I, there couldn't have been a greater contrast than what I saw today. 34th District Assemblyman Tom Lackey was in attendance and walked away impressed. I have interest uh, in this in this race, and he won me over. I'm definitely endorsing him. Cameras didn't get a good look at DeSantis this morning. He left the country club through a back entrance and did not meet with the press. Attendees say that DeSantis never mentioned California Governor Gavin Newsom or his state flying migrants to the capital region this month. He didn't mention that particular issue, and he never mentioned uh, the governor's name. And that DeSantis has no need to debate or discuss with Governor Newsom. I don't think that those, that really was what occupies his mind. I think that those are uh, issues that, uh, that interest maybe the press. Well, Lackey calls it more palace intrigue than anything. Well, governor Newsom really wants uh, to live rent free in Governor DeSantis's head, and it is absolutely not the case. As both agree that the race for the Republican nomination with former President Trump still leading DeSantis in California polls will be an important one. I think that uh, Governor DeSantis is going to make a very strong case in getting support. I think that right now as Republicans, we have an embarrassment of riches. That is exciting for us, and especially here in California, because we are an early state, a delegate rich state. This is exciting for us. Now, we're still over a year away from the Republican convention, but as of now, it appears to be a two-man race at the top of the Republican ticket between Governor DeSantis and former President Trump.